We are a 501c3 charity that supports local type 1 diabetic children and their families. Well, my son Michael was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes when he was 6 and his diagnosis was pretty traumatic. He was very ill but he did recover and when we were leaving the hospital the doctor his only explanation for why he actually walked out pretty much okay was that it was a miracle. I don't know, the mascot, I'm the figurehead. It's me, I have it, I'm in the book. What's it for? Uh, being the most diabetic person alive, aka getting a blood sugar of exactly 2656 mg slash dl. Don't ask me what that means. And the normal blood sugar is, no, you know, 80, 100, normal around there, and I was 2656 mg slash dl. What do you think you would be doing if you weren't in Michael's Miracles? That's a very good question. I don't know because it consumes a lot of my life. It's a, a lot of work. Uh, it's hard hard work on his end, hard work on our end, to keep his uh, you know blood sugars level and stable. Do you think he manages his diabetes well? I think so, yeah. You know, yeah, he jokes about you know things like that, but I think he manages himself pretty well. Well, it's a constant thought in the back of your head. You know, before he eats, he needs to check. Before I can go to sleep, I need to check his blood sugars to make sure they're at a good level. We are trying to broad base our support through different sponsors, try to get support from local merchants and from hospitals. We support many families. I have a monthly support group where all the kids are welcome to come. It's a great chance for them to get to know each other. We have social activities we run for the families. We send 10 kids to diabetes camp every summer. We provide care packages to newly diagnosed families. We have uh, four or five fundraisers throughout the year, and that's how basically we raise our funds. Sometimes I think, you know, everything happens for a reason, so now we get to share our experiences with other families that you know, happen to follow in the same footsteps we have. My thought on that is that they will come up with a way to prevent it for new families before they'll find a cure. Uh, I know they're making a lot of big strides in finding a cure. I'm not sure if they will, but I'm very hopeful. I hope. That's my fondest hope. Yo, bro, check out Michael's Miracle! Woo! Dot com. Actually, it's dot net.